how Buckingham Palace runs huge risk with royal baby Dasha nobody would believe them again. Meghan Markle and Prince Harry's baby can leave Buckingham Palace with egg on its face for one particular reason, and the public would never believe them again, claimed former Palace Press Secretary Dickie Arbiter. Buckingham Palace would lose the public's trust if the royal baby had arrived and they denied its birth, claimed a former royal press secretary. Dickie Arbiter said the palace has categorically denied Meghan and Harry's baby has arrived, and would end up with egg on its face if this was proved to be false. Mr Arbiter told Nine News Australia, there are rumours, there's always going to be rumours floating around. The palace really did come out quite strongly and categorically denied that the baby was here. Now they are not going to deny if they are not absolutely sure, if they did deny and the baby was here they would really end up with egg on their face and nobody would ever believe them again. So this is a categorical denial, everybody will know in good time when the baby is here. Right now, it isn't. The former press spokesman for the Queen added, the true indication that the baby has arrived will be an announcement, plain and simple as that. As we heard from Harry and Meghan late last month that they are not going to announce the birth right away. They want a few days to bond with the baby before they make the announcement. They are going to do it in their time and not do it to order by the media. The Queen was close to Meghan and Harry yesterday, attending a service in Windsor during the afternoon. Her Majesty was present at a service of the Royal Victorian Order at St. George's Chapel, which is where Meghan, 37 and Harry, 34, got married in May 2018. Earlier this week it is understood the Queen was the first guest at the royal couple's new Frogmore Cottage residence. A royal insider told The Sun, Her Majesty wanted to formally welcome the Sussexes to their new home so she was their first visitor. After all, They've practically moved into her back garden. She visited with other family members and Harry and Meghan were delighted to show them round. Meghan's father Thomas Markle has also been spotted collecting a takeaway meal in Mexico as the world await the arrival of his grandchild. Mr Markle was pictured with a meal to go from sushi restaurant Teriyaki in the coastal city of Rosarito. It appears Meghan's father has no plans to make the 5,500-mile journey to the UK for the birth. Meanwhile, it is understood Meghan's mother Doria Ragland is already in Britain staying with the Duke and Duchess of Sussex in Frogmore Cottage after a dog walker was seen taking her pet for a walk near her property in Los Angeles. Bookmakers are convinced the royal baby is a girl after a flurry of betters backed a little princess. According to Patty Power, the most likely name is Diana, 31, though Grace, 71, Allegra, 81, and Alice, 101. The firm said, we've suspended betting on which day Harry and Meghan's baby will arrive following a huge increase in wagers. That, combined with the rumors and speculation has us convinced that the royal arrival has already happened and if the betting is anything to go by, it's almost certainly a baby girl.